Nahum, Nahum chapter 1. I am Nahum from Elkosh, and this is the message that I wrote down about Nineveh. The Lord God demands loyalty. In his anger, he takes revenge on his enemies. The Lord is powerful yet patient. He makes sure that the guilty are always punished. He can be seen in storms and in whirlwinds. Clouds are the dust from his feet. At the Lord's command, oceans and rivers dry up. Bashan, Mount Carmel, and Lebanon wither and their flowers fade. At the sight of the Lord, mountains and hills tremble and melt. The earth and its people shudder and shake. Who can stand the heat of his furious anger? It flashes out like fire and shatters stones. The Lord is good. He protects those who trust him in times of trouble. But like a roaring flood, the Lord chases his enemies into dark places and destroys them. So don't plot against the Lord. He wipes out his enemies, and they never revive. They are like drunkards overcome by wine, or like dry thorn bushes burning in a fire. Assyria, one of your rulers has made evil plans against the Lord. But the Lord says... Assyria, no matter how strong you are, you are doomed. My people Judah, I have troubled you before, but I won't do it again. I'll snap your chains and set you free from the Assyrians. Assyria, this is what else the Lord says to you. Your name will be forgotten. I will destroy every idol in your temple, and I will send you to the grave because you are worthless. Look toward the mountains, people of Judah. Here comes a messenger with good news of peace. Celebrate your festivals. Keep your promises to God. Your evil enemies are destroyed and will never again invade your country.